hey hi team so recently i found one website to learn to gain uh, theoretical knowledge about mainframe modernization and uh, how we can do integration main with the python and mainframe with java so on all of them okay we found some uh, official content so i'm going to explain to you that so how we can uh, you know do those learnings how you can gain knowledge the main reason to create this video i used to get every weekly, weekly minimum 10 uh, you know calls or messages okay through calls or message i used to get 10 requests per week stating that venkat can you please guide us mainframe modernization can you please give some knowledge on mainframe modernization and so on so here is the solution for for all of them and for everyone as well as so this is very useful uh, information for you to at least to start to gain what is what so that that extent you can learn from this particular uh, you know my with my information that i can 100% can tell you so yeah, I, I did not create any video by the way. It is official IBM website I am referring. Okay, so you guys can do one thing. You can go to this URL. This is the URL. Okay, if you, I guess you would have seen this link somewhere else also. It is perfectly fine. So this is the uh, official URL. Okay, IBM URL. So IBM is the one who are providing, uh, the who are providing you the, you know, learning and the videos for you on mainframe modern and modernization and so on so first you launch this url then you can see ibm z mainframe skills dip okay so you can see all mainframe related stuff i can say advanced not even in it's not basics also it is a bit of advanced okay so who want to learn mainframe modernization who want to learn python with the mainframe for them this video this information going to help you but not JCL, not COBOL, DB2, and all, not the basic vanilla skills. Okay. So once you launch this URL, you can go through, you know, uh, we have three flavors. They are providing three flavors to us. If you want to learn uh, mainframe system administrator, uh, administrator content, then there is a one track. And if you want to learn developer uh, related content like uh, COBOL, Java, Python, so then you can choose this particular track and modernization architect so if you want to integrate mainframe applications into the broader enterprise uh, like Ava, uh, devops okay or uh, how you can integrate with the apis for all of them you can go with this particular track so it depends on your experience and what is your requirement okay some people wants to learn mainframe system uh, pro administrator then you can come here and refer it so i'll try to explain everything in high level what is what so how you can learn it so to do this first you have to register in this particular ibm official website okay so once you click on i'll, I'll go to another one i opened the same url in incognito so i did not do assume that i did not do registration or i don't have any credentials if that is the case what you can do once you do this start your learning path it will take to you the another page then sign in or create an ibm id it is you no need to uh, be an ibm employee to do that okay it is not required so even you can use your gmail id you to learn so i'll click on create an ibm id then if you have a user id password well and good generally ibm id will be your mail id it can be your official mail id or it can be your gmail id or it can be ahu mail id i tried with mail id gmail id so i can tell you confidently gmail id is working perfectly fine for me so let's say i don't have an account there might be a question from you right then click on create an ibm id and from here you complete the entire registration okay it takes hardly two three minutes so you will get some at the end you will get the one verification code to your email id how to enter so once you come once you complete the registration and you can log in it 
once you do login how the a screen looks like how you can navigate and I'll, I'll guide you let's say now I am here okay so you can see okay my ID and all I logged in already that's why you are able to see my IBM and so on now I click on start your learning path so I told you right so there are three tracks there are three for you know there are three roles content is here one is system uh, administrator the other one is application developer content the third one is modernization architect so whichever the role you want to or whichever the role role related content you want to learn so select that first i would like to talk about application developer then i will go through other tracks also other roles also now i selected application developer role so this is the one where you want to start from the basics so there are three sub components are there there are three tracks are there under this particular one so basics you know if you want to learn some hands-on gain hands-on experience through labs determine mainframe application developer so you can do this ibm z g101 so application developer or uh, this is the say it's 201 and app modernization so this is totally you know as a developer also you can develop some applications with the modernization so that time you need to choose it if i scroll down nothing here for me you can see some description about that what you can gain and all so from experts now i am selecting start this learning tracks i clicked on it it went again another page so they given what you are going to learn as simple as okay this learning track contains 300 hours even if you pay two two lakhs i know you can convert into dollars by the way two lakhs indian rupees also if you spend three lakhs also you don't get this much content that i can tell you i can pro you know i can tell you confidently you know, as a trainer from based on my experience so and the self-based hands-on training or uh, to prepare your mainframe application developer so there is some hands-on also is there and so what you're going to learn like ansible java python hicks ims docker and so on so as i told you this video is not uh, targeted one resource so there are some senior who are having 20 people might be watching my youtube channel uh, my referring for them and some people who are having three years they want to learn something related to cobol there are some people who are mid experience like 15 10 so they want to learn java with mainframe python with the mainframe for them also this is going to help you now so you know if you don't know devops if you don't know uh, in the cloud and all always better to learn basics okay either you can do google certification or azure or microsoft somewhere start doing the certification because going forward in a, you know our life we keep hearing cloud devops and all at least the basics okay what is a cloud component services of the cloud how it looks like how cloud works similarly devops and artificial intelligence basics i am not asking you to get, get into deeper now coming to the context here so application developer 201 now i can scroll down yeah you can see more if you click on see more there are so many things right now what i select to i'll select as we are the programmer i will focus on the programming languages okay so then eventually you guys can go to each one so in this particular folder or in this particular component there are eight courses are there i clicked on it now you scroll down so program cobalt program with a visual vs means visual studio code okay so how we can execute our cobalt programs with the visual studio code okay this helps to learn the structure of the cobalt program data type variable and free defined functions all of them with this so now this is the one uh, next the java on jetways for uh, for java programmers java on 
ZOS. Okay, so even we can learn this one also. Though just if you know the basics, already you know COBOL. If you know COBOL, data types and the syntaxes might vary, but you are good to learn this. Okay, let's see whether it is a free of cost or not. Eventually we will look into that. I'll click on. So here I have only enroll option. Enroll now. So I need to start the course. Okay, so there is a welcome. There is a complete get started. So you can go through all of them team. So because if I go through all of them, it takes it might take some time. So complete just to navigate the things. I guess I need to complete few more things, then I'll be coming here okay but i hope you got it the path right so you need to see this and completion and all start your course what it is coming we'll look into that so create an ibm already we have an ibm id we logged in it so it, it doesn't ask you again so come here so sometimes it may not work in the, this particular browser then you try to log in from other browser and you will be able to see the content you see that so welcome to kubal there is a quiz and how you need to install visual studio code if you don't know visual studio code just go there vs uh, download it is a for free app cost it is easy only like uh, you know since you are main prime developer you may not be we may not be knowing more about IDEs, integrated development environments. So Visual Studio Code, Eclipse, these are all the IDEs to do the hands-on. You can download them. It's a free app cost, okay? Open open source also there. You can download and install it. Then how to, you know, uh, do the hands-on everything they mention here. So scroll down. They talked about divisions. Then they talked about it. So this is how you can okay this is how you can complete this cobalt stuff now that is all about cobalt now what else we can learn as a main frame okay so scroll down i guess we can think something about this also so this is only one hour content when it comes to the cobalt program with the vs code 18 hours content and this is one hour content select Java on ZOS. Same. Okay, you need to navigate one by one, then you will get to know. Start codes. Okay, I'll go expand. Then start codes. Okay, so continue. This is on there on a different interskill. I want to highlight this one also. Although learning videos and stuff is not there in the IBM. So IBM inter, you know, I guess they associate with the interskill. So this material is offered on the interskill. I don't know whether it is a uh, pre-op cost or it is cost involved. Okay. So you need to go through the statement. Then you need to come to the conclusion whether it is a cost involved or not. Okay. While you are watching this video, you can share your view and your feedback. So continue on interskill. So this is the one where you can find all mainframe stuff. You need to have an account, okay? So you need to have an account. You need to create an account and uh, after that, you can watch this video. So what IBM, they did it team. So they kept some videos on their own uh, website, IBM website. There are some videos they kept in different uh, vendors, their vendors. So I'll come again here. And the another advantage of this one team, you will get the badge. Okay, that will help you to show to project your managers, your seniors, okay, during performance. And this is something I learned. Okay, this is the badge I got it. So at least some, you know, they might ask you at the end of the year or quarterly what you learned and all right. So that time it is going to help you. Okay, so that is all about programming languages. So if I come to web development open source how it is related to mainframe uh, introduction to software engineering is up to you, you know uh, 
so i don't see anything if you want to become 100 uh, percent you know yeah so it's all about web front end only i can see but where it is going to help us in mainframe this is the one so if you want to develop apis that time javascript is going to help you that is offered by coursera okay i don't think all of them free okay yeah you see there is a no cost no cost means which you can access it okay uh, another point i want to highlight where is there is no cost so you can do learning so you need to have the respect to website uh, credentials also you need to do registration and do login okay so for safer side don't add your credit card details anywhere uh, sometimes uh, the amount will be deducted without knowing you so I mean, we may not focus that much on it so hence you should be careful on it that is all about application developer and uh, when it comes to modernization architect so scroll down same here you can see the this is if you see this particular modernization or not one where you have to start you will get the learning path you know what is main for modernization again this is no cost 30 minutes is the one so i completed this this time i said next click the next 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 okay and mainframe application modernization patterns in hybrid cloud so this is all about it i'll go back to this one and you can go through one by one how mainframe is integrated with the devops all of them you can learn from here okay so i always say that okay this is better than nothing which means that we have very less resources on mainframe modernization okay and not sufficient not authenticated so everyone will share their own stuff but this is the one where we can learn authenticated the information the document content over here okay so that's all for this video so i'll try to explore more stuff related to mainframe i'll upload there so please do subscribe share your comments if you find something else please give in the comments in the under that we, this video so that i can try to create a one more video i'll bring awareness to everyone that's all thing